Morning Thailand supported by Sea Thai Superwear. Wings Learning Circle, customized English course for your business. And welcome back to the program. You're watching Morning Thailand with Tulip Golf and of course Kun Chain. สวัสดีค่ะสวัสดีครับสวัสดีครับ Now Kun Chain, um, there's mm -hmm. probably going to be a lot of talk. Obviously today they're going to talk about the the whole um, report on mm -hmm. the performance for the last year. But I think the most looking at issue at this point is the two trillion baht loan. Um, especially the Democrat Party seems to, you know, have their own project going on, and they say that they don't need it. <laughs> what is the the private sector thing? The the um, academic, the especially academic. Uh, the TI, right? The Thai Research Development Institute. Not surprisingly, the the bill has already passed mm -hmm. last week. Mm -hmm. It's quite crystal all the reading. Of course, uh -huh. and we kind of uh, that. <laughs> uh, I think what uh, what Ajahn Sumit. Ong Kakitikun, the senior academic at TI, mm -hmm. uh, made comments about this uh, particular loan bill. is quite interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm, the thing is that actually we would have to try to start thinking if it would worth the money. Mm -hmm. oh. mm -hmm. that, that is what he said, and I mm -hmm. quote. Because he said, if we look at the strategy, uh, it has been said that the, the bill is there to reduce the cost. So it's quite mainly about the high-speed train and mm -hmm. railway and uh, other infrastructure development of the country. Right, mm -hmm. which is in the long term. I mean, uh -huh. if you look at, you know, on the bright side, that's actually good foundation mm -hmm. for the country. Uh, the project is believed to be effective, uh, especially on the low-cost transportation. Mm -hmm. This is there to help reduce the production cost. Uh, but in reality, the railway network of our country has only 4,000 kilometers in length. Oh. While the road network is much longer, it mm. is uh, 200,000 kilometers wow. in length. So the railway cannot cover all the regions of the country. Especially mm -hmm. at this point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh, according to him, it might help reduce somewhat cost, as it also depends on where the new railways will be built mm -hmm. uh, and if the money would be economic, uh, wisely used. Mm. Right. Mm -hmm. Especially, uh, he said that uh, the high-speed trend do not help reduce, this is a high-speed high trend. Mm -hmm. Right. It would not help reduce the transportation cost. Mm. Oh. Because uh, the thing is that the rationale behind this of, uh, is it, it is a development of transportation system, which is to reduce logistic costs. Right. Uh, we have to build double railway if mm -hmm. we oh, really need to increase okay. capacity. Oh, but so uh, the, the double railway, uh, the other parallel railway, uh -huh. is uh, it, it will have only 20 to 25 percent of the budget in, in the bill, oh. while 39 percent is for the high speed train. Oh. oh. Which, <laughs> which is very, <laughs> very <laughs> unclear how it will cover the country. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And it is not for the products. It's for the mass transportation. Oh, that's different. If they talk about logistics, supposed to be for the commercial use. I and mean, not for for the um, goods transportation. And don't use. forget, our country is not that big, so people can still drive. Uh -huh. mm. So maybe True. road would be better. So or maintain uh, the one that we already have. The worst thing <laughs> is that the fare would be extremely expensive. Oh, oh great! Because the, uh, the the budget and all, all mm. the costs in building the, the high speed train. So they have to make some profit afterwards. So yes. it won't be really helpful much, mm -hmm. isn't it? We need Actually, to know more at, about at this the project. Side, True. If, if we must try mm -hmm. to look at it, uh, it might help boost the economic. It might. Mm -hmm. Right. Because the sky train expansion as well, and mm -hmm. uh, there might be a development. Uh, in land along the, the railway, mm -hmm. but it would take lots of time. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, he, he suggested many countries are uh, doing this very step by step, but mm -hmm. for Thailand, it's quite a big leap. Right, so we're mm -hmm. trying to shorten the time mm -hmm. by just injecting in mm -hmm. this big, big money. I think, Kun Chen, like you said before, one of the really big things that keep everybody kind of opposed to the idea because the uh, government hasn't give much details or information on how they will allocate all this, this is, money. This is mm. one of the things too. I'm just starting to wondering and whether or not they did not give it to us or we just not or they don't have any. Yeah, or <laughs> no, 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 or where we're uh, not searching for because it. Because like you, you said, I mean? South. It sounds like when you say from the TDI, it mm -hmm. even sounds like a lot of this from it's 
came from the assumption of how it would be used mm -hmm, because mm -hmm. we they don't have the detail also. D actually, they provide the detail, but there, is, the there is a big loophole of, of this bill. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's called the attachment uh, letter. Oh. oh. Uh, according to the letter, they can the, the government can actually adjust, adjust the project, oh. and they may even cut or add anything in if but they don't the don't feel that the project mm -hmm. do not respond to their voters. Right. I think the thing is, is, is like one of those things, like I'm not lying to you, but I'm not just giving you all the information. But in this case, I think giving them a benefit of a doubt is that mm -hmm. maybe the information was there, but it was the citizens, it's mm -hmm. us, ourselves, that might not. I haven't go and search for it. Maybe if I go and do a little bit more research on this particular bill and see mm -hmm. what kind of money they will be right. using it Actually, for, I might know more. L let me tell you the scariest part okay. of this. There's uh, more. <laughs> <laughs> the, respon uh, the responsible authority is the State Railway of Thailand. Which what? Already <laughs> the whole kind of project. Uh, is, is the they, they're quite uh, not very effective. No. Uh, <laughs> according to the TI, if, if we uh, have to give them some money uh, to do this. Actually, <laughs> because it's he, he said that the, the organization has uh, organized, uh, they have to look at the uh, human resource right. management right. and the uh, organizational structure. Yeah, of, which is going to be hard. Organization. Or we can just look at it a simple way. There was just another development again yesterday, the yeah, train. But then uh -huh. that's, they're going to say that that's because <laughs> they don't have enough money to <laughs> actually, you know, Actually, they're, they're quite slow at spending money because uh, in the past they got 170 billion baht budget Ooh. okay how much to they build use? uh parallel railways right that right. we really need in this country okay but up to now the budget has been spent only 10 billion baht why wow so mm -hmm. they have the money they need but they, they, have, they have all the money but they they just <laughs> don't have they're the quite slow like and uh i i think there's a lot of mis mismanagement and uh, you know yeah, human resource problems. Yeah, it's just so sad. So can can we so say that the TI quite suggest that mm. we should let the private company take step in this? But that would make would mm -hmm. that make it more expensive? Yeah. No. And plus, we, the there, thing there is are so many examples mm -hmm. that uh, we may use the BOT or bill operate and transfer and so so many so right. hire uh -huh. someone else to do it instead of using this money, giving it to a. We budget. don't even have to hire them. We Maybe we can open for a bit. Con make contracts and yeah, so but then mm -hmm. that's gonna end up like uh, tollway and such, where there's like a lot of you know concessions. So I guess they have to increase, and then the government has nothing to say. But that's to depend it. on the contract, the government, the detail of the contract. The government that's what I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> it depends on the detail. Oh, we might not hear wow. about the detail until later on when it's mm -hmm. already signed. But Kunchen, um, the Democrat Party, no, the opposition said that oh. Although we all expect that it will totally pass, mm -hmm. um, Democrat Party said they will uh, p send petition to the constitution constitutional court. Mm -hmm. Will it help anything if they will let constitutional court decide? That'd I think up to uh, th that would be up to the court. Mm -hmm. One thing, and I really doubt if the opposition party can do anything. Or oh, have any say in anything? It's hard right now. because you know mm -hmm. we we still go with the demo democracy mm -hmm. of the majority vote win kind of thing. So they can try. They can try. Mm -hmm. They can try. I guess and see. Yeah. Right. That's the only thing they can do. All moment. right. That's all the time we have, have wait. for <laughs> everyone mm -hmm. today. Thanks for you guys at all tuning in for Morning Thailand. And you can check all episode playback on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Morning Thailand. Mm -hmm. Or our Facebook page, facebook.com slash Morning Thailand. And you can also email us at morningthailandshow at gmail.com. Mm -hmm. And we would like to thank our lovely sponsors. Yeah, CC Double for the lovely top, as well as Thai Superwear Quality the World Trust, Wings Learning Circle, customized English course for your business. As for today, I'm Golf. Tulip. Chain. Sorry. Sorry.